Welcome to the Iron Horse Tracker, tracking the latest stories from Multinational Division Baghdad and the 4th Infantry Division. I'm Sergeant Kyle Flieger. Staff Sergeant Vin Stevens tells us how leaders react to a car bomb in the Rashid District. The commander of the 7th Squadron, 10th Cavalry Regiment, Lieutenant Colonel Troy Smith, held an emergency leaders meeting recently at the Abitashir Police Station in Baghdad's Rashid District. Colonel Smith called leaders together after criminals detonated a car bomb in the local community. The attack killed several Iraqi citizens and damaged a local business. Citizens rioted against the local Iraqi Security Forces, or ISF, who they blamed for the attack. Colonel Smith addressed the security issue and said the ISF were not responsible for the car bomb. This event was not caused by the Shirkawakaniya, the local police, or any of the security forces working in and out of Abitashir. Colonel Smith also said that the citizens of Abitashir need to follow the rule of law and trust the Iraqi security forces. They've got to fully back the Iraqi security forces that are here to protect them. And I expect the Iraqi security forces, police, and Shirkawakaniya, supported by coalition forces, to do everything in their power to protect the people. Reporting for 1st Brigade, 4th Infantry Division, I'm Army Staff Sergeant Vin Stevens, Multinational Division Baghdad, Iraq. And now, this week's Moment of Valor. On the evening of April 11, 2008, Steel Company with the 1st Combined Arms Battalion, 68th Armor Regiment, 3rd Brigade Combat Team, 4th Infantry Division, was providing security for the route clearance and barrier emplacement missions along Route Gold. A route clearance team with Sergeant Rudy Williams' M1A2 tank section and 1M2 Bradley providing security turned onto gold and was immediately struck by multiple IEDs. At the same time, the team came under heavy RPG and machine gun fire. As his tank maneuvered to protect the casualty evacuation, Sergeant Williams engaged numerous enemy RPG teams with main gun rounds and the coax. Through aggressive scanning and overwhelming firepower, Sergeant Williams provided security along the entire flank of the route clearance team and destroyed a cache in the Triggerman's building. The secondary explosions forced the enemy to break contact. For his actions, Sergeant Williams was awarded the Bronze Star with the device for Valor. That concludes today's Iron Horse Tracker. To learn more about the soldiers and units supporting Multinational Division Baghdad and the 4th Infantry Division, Check out our website at www.hood.army.mil/4id. From Baghdad, I'm Sergeant Kyle Krieger. <laughs>